Good morning, STM. My name is Neruz, and here are your announcements for today. A reminder that after school, math tutoring is running every Monday and Wednesday in room 20 to 50, from 2.45 to 4.50. You can pick up a tutoring form in the guidance department. Please bring a completed form on your first day of tutoring. Lunch lawn is be beginning provided today by your prefects during period three and four in room 220. <laughs> Come out to play board games, have some snacks, do your homeworks, or hang just hang out. Thanks, STM. This is a me message from the junior football coach to all grade nine boys interested in begin part of the grade nine touch football team. There will be a brief information session and sign up in the lecture hall tomorrow, March 22nd at 2.50 p.m. The junior boys soccer tryouts were resume today after school on the field for the grade not tens interested in trying out. Thanks, STM. Hello, STM. So this is a message regarding our swim team. So my name is Mr. Tarquinio and I coach a swim team alongside Mr. Thurston. Mrs. Bayliss and Ms. Burita. So we're here today to congratulate all swimmers who worked hard all year as we competed in GHAC and OFSA. So this year we had 14 students in total compete in GHAC and of these 14, three advanced to OFSA provincials. So of these three who advanced to OFSA, we have Connor Woodworth, this way, <laughs> who placed 14, 14th in his 100 meter freestyle preliminaries to advance to the finals. And in the finals, he finished 11th place overall in his individual event. We have Juliet Nguyen, who finished 11th overall in her 100 meter freestyle and also finished 9th place overall in her, in her 100 meter freestyle. And Zach Ridgway, who finished 12th place overall in his 50 meter freestyle. All of our OFSA athletes also beat their, their personal bests. So we'd also like to congratulate our GHAC competitors who missed this year's OFSA times just by a little bit. Uh, first, we have our junior boys relay consisting of Yusuf Safi, Matt Obravac, Vasco Fontes, and Hayden and Isaiah Pert, who won first place in our city champs in their relay event. We'd also like to give a special shout out to Mackenzie Whitehorse, who won gold in her individual event at cities as well. So STM, if you see any of these athletes in the hallway, please congratulate them. And again, great job to all swimmers on the team who worked hard this year. Many of you joined as the team as rookies and were unfamiliar with certain events, but through your perseverance and teamwork, you all improved greatly throughout the season. So you should all be very, very proud of all these accomplishments. And lastly, swimmers, please pay attention to any upcoming announcements and updates regarding the end of the season items and team meeting. And thank you again, and keep up the good work nights. Woo! Good morning, STM. I'm Adriana. And I'm Rachel, and we are here for your student council announcements. Tomorrow, March 21st, is World Down Syndrome Day. This day is celebrated on the 21st day of the third month to signify the uniqueness of the triplication of the 21st chromosome, which causes Down Syndrome. Tomorrow, everyone is encouraged to wear fun, colorful socks to raise further awareness and break stereotypes around Down Syndrome. A reminder to pick up your spirit wear sweaters during your lunch periods at the student council office if you haven't done that already. Thanks, thanks, yes, yeah.